بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم العبودية وفشاك السلام ابن تيمية ابن تيمية اسي اون سافيتود ابن تيمية اسي اون سافيتود all praise for Allah we praise him and seek, he, and seek his help and uh, forgiveness we seek refuge in Allah and from the evil of ourselves uh, ourselves and the weakness of our own deeds Whomsoever Allah guides uh, cannot be led astray, and whomsoever Allah gives guides, none can guide him. I bear witness that none has the right to be worshipped by Allah, along with any person, and I bear witness that Muhammad is his slave and messenger of Allah. Sheikh Islam, the most, the most, the, uh, the Sheikh Islam, the famous of the of the famous, protector of the Sunnah, and the suppressor of, of innovation. Ahmad ibn Halib ibn Taymiyyah, may Allah have mercy upon him, was questioned on the saying of Allah. Of Allah, 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 of What is Allah, worship? What, what are its branches? Is the wall of the deen, uh, is the wall of the deen embodied within it? What is the reality of Buddhist servitude? It, is it the highest attainable station in this world and in the hereafter? Or are there other stations above it? Please elaborate for us in all of this. Does Ibn Taymiyyah Allah have mercy upon him replied uh, introduction Ibadah is a comprehensive term that encompasses everything that Allah loves and is pleased with of both statements and actions both the apparent and hidden hence prayer, zakah, hence prayer zakah, fasting, hajj, be, being truthful in speech fulfilling one's trust, kindness towards parent maintaining relationship with kin, fulfilling pledges commanding the good, forbidding the evil jihad against the, the disbelievers and the hypocrites being beneficent towards the neighbor, the orphan, the poor person, the traveler and their own human or animal, supplication, remembrance of Allah, the citation of the Quran and the lack of such are all types of worship. Likewise, is the case with is the case with the love of Allah and his messenger, reverence of Allah, turning to Allah in repentance, sincerity of deen for him, patience with his judgment, gratitude for his favours, contentment of with his degree, tawakkul upon him, hope for his mercy. Fear of, his, fear of his punishment and the lack of such all other forms of worship of Allah. This is so because this is this is so because worship of Allah is the end objective that is beloved to him and he is what pleases him. It is the purpose for which he created the creation. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has uh, said, And I have not created the jinn and mankind except that they should worship me alone. He sent all the messengers with, with, with this worship. As when Nu said to his people, Abdullah Malakum in Hiroho, worship Allah, you have no other deity but him. Likewise, Hud, Saleh, Shweb, and others say the same to their people. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Wala Kadba Atana fi Kulumat Rasulani Abdullah Hussani Buddhawood, Faminu Manahad Allah, Waminu Makatalit Dalala. And verily, we have sent amongst every nation a messenger saying, Worship Allah alone, and avoid all false deities. Then of them, then the, then of them was some whom Allah guided, and of them was some upon whom the whom the string string was uh, was justified. Allah Allah Subhanahu wa Taala says, "Wa ma arsalna min kablika min Rasul illa nuhi lehi anna hu la ilaha illa anna faabudun." And we did not send any messenger before you, O Muhammad, and we revealed unto him that none has to be worshipped, but uh, in truth, but Allah. So worship me alone. Allah Subhanahu wa Taala says, "Inna hadi huma tukumata wahida." But well, this Ummah of yours is one Ummah, and I am your Lord, therefore worship me alone. Allah also says in, in another ayah, Ya ayyuh rusulu kulu min tayyibati wa amalu sa'inni bima ta'amun alim, wa inna hadi ummatukum matan wahida, wa an rabbukum fattakun. O messengers, eat of the good things and perform righteous deeds, verily I am well acquainted with, with all that you do, and well this Ummah of yours is one Ummah, and I am your Lord, therefore have talk of me. Allah made this worship binding upon his messenger until the until until dead or as he Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam says, Wa abudu Rabbak hatta yatiyak al yakin, and worship your Lord of Muhammad until there comes unto, unto you the yakin, that is the hawa that is Satan Satan the, the, the hawa that is Satan and that is dead. With this with this depiction of worship, he describes his angels and and prophets. He Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, To him belong to belongs to whoever whoever is in the heavens and the earth. And those who are with him, that is the angels, not to disdain to worship him, and they never become weary. They exalt him right and day, never slackening. Allah says, 
ان الذين عند ربك لا يستكبرون عن عباده ويسبحونه ولا ولا يسجدون شوالي دوسو ار ود يو لو دو نوت ديس دين تو ورشيب هيم دي اكزالت هيم اند بروستريت بيفور هيم على سنس دوسو ار تو هوتي اند برو تو ورشيب هيم ان هي سين ان هي سين سبحانه وتعالى سين وقا ربكم ادعوني استجب لكم ان الذين استكبروا عباده سيدخلون جهنم داخرين and the Lord said invoke me I will respond to you into you to your invo into your invocation valid those whom those who scorn by my 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 worship will enter will enter hell in humiliation he also described the finest of his cre of, of his creatures with servitude to him Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said aina yashru biha ibadullahi yufajru aina yashru biha ibadullahi yufajruna ha tafjira a fountain where the ibadat is worshippers of Allah will drink Make it, making, making it gush forth in abundance. He said, Allah also said, وَإِبَادُ الرَّحْمَانِ لَدِينَ مِشْرَ الْعَرْضِ دِهُونَ وَإِذَا كَاتَبَهُمْ جَهِلُونَ قَالُوا سَلَامًا And the Ibadu of Ar-Rahman are those who walk upon the earth in humility. And when the foolish address them, they reply with words of gentleness. Furthermore, when Shaitan said, رَبِّي إِنَّمَا غَوَيْتَنِي لَأَوْزَنَ لَهُمْ فِي الْأَرْضِ وَلَوْجَنَهُمْ أَجْمَئِينَ For them that is mankind on earth, and they shall mislead them all, save your chosen, guided ibad among them. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala replied, Inna ibadi lay salaka alihim sultan, illa man talaka al-gawin, certainly you have no authority over my ibad, except those who follow you out, follow you of the errand. Furthermore, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in connection in describing the angels with this servitude, Wa qalit taqadar rahman wa lada subhanah, bal ibadun mukramun, la yasbiqunahu bil qoluhum bi amrihi ya'amalun, يعلو ما بين يديه وما خلفهم ولا يشفون إلا لمن ارتدى له إلى من ارتدى ومن خشيته مشفقون and they say الرحمن as we got in children how perfect he is they are but honored ibad they not speak until he has spoken and they act by his command he knows what is before them and what is behind them they cannot intercede except for one who he himself is pleased with and they stand in awe for fear of him Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala also says وقالوا اتقد الرحمن ولدا لقد جيتم شيئا ادا تكاد السماوات يتفطرن منه تشق الارض وتخير الجبال هدا عند اول الرحمن ردا وما ينبغي الرحمن تكد ولدا ان كل من في السماوات يرد الا اتي الرحمن ابدا لقد احساهم وعدهم ادا وكلهم اتي يوم القيامه فردا ان دي ان دي سي الرحمن اس بكوتين شيلدرن ان دي يو هاف بروت فور ذا تريبو او ايفو دين ذا هيفنز ار ابوت سبريت بابات ذا ات سبريت اسندا اند ذا مونتينز فول ان روينز ان ذات ذا سكريتشرن تو الرحمن It is not befitting the majesty of Ar-Rahman that he should have a good children. There is none in the heavens and the earth but comes unto Ar-Rahman. As an, as, as an abd, verily he knows their number, and as enumerated, as enumerated them from most divinity and presently, every one of them will come to him on the day of resurrection alone. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says regarding Al-Masih, uh, that is Prophet Isa alayhi salatu wa salam, to whom divinity and, 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 and such to Allah wa al wa, 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 إن هو إلا عبد أمنا عليه وجعلنا وجعلنا له مثلا لبني إسرائيل. He that is Isa was was no more than an abd. We favored him and made him an example for the children of Israel. This is why the Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم said as the as said as in the authentic hadith. Do not do not praise me as the Christians have praised Isa, son of Maryam. For and do not any praise me. Do not exert any praising me. And you can praise the Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم. Isa son of Maryam, for I'm only an abd, so say Abdullah, that is the abd of Allah and his messenger. Furthermore, Allah described the messenger with the ubudiyya in his most perfect state. Isa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said in deference to al-Isra, that is the night jani. Subhan ladhi asad bi abdi laylan, exalted is he, that is Allah, who took his abd, that is Muhammad, for a jani by night. Isa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said in deference to receiving revelation. Oha ila abdihi ma oha, so did Allah reveal to his abd what he revealed through the angel Jibreel, through the angel Jibreel. Jibrail. In reference to the station, in reference to the station of Dawa, Isa Allah Sallam said, "وَأَنَّهُ لَمَّا قَامَ عَبْدُ اللَّهِ يَدُهُ كَادُ يَكُونَ لَهِ إِلِبَدَةً وَأَنَّ أَنْوَنَ عَبْدُ اللَّهِ دَاتِ الْعَبْدُ فَاللَّهُ مُحَمَّدٌ سُلَبْ كَالِيَانَ تُهِيمْ دَاتِ الْعَلَّاهِ دَعَدَ الْعَجِينَ إِسْتِيمَ الْعَلَمُوَسْ سَبْرِسْرِيمْ." Allah Subhanahu wa Taala said in reference to the challenge of producing anything like the Quran, "وَإِنْ كُنْتُمْ فِي رَيْمَ نَزَلْنَا عَلَى عَبْدِنَا فَأَتُوا بِسُرَتِ مِمْتِلِهِ And if you are in doubt concerning that which we have sent down to our Lord as our Abd, uh, that is Messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, then produce a surah of its life. Hence the deen in, uh, the deen in its entirety is embodied within Ibadah. 
It has been established in the Sahih that when Jibreel came to the Prophet in the appearance of Miriam and questioned him about Islam, he answered, Islam that you justify that none has the right to be worshipped except Allah and that Muhammad is the Messenger of Allah, that you establish prayer, give zakah, fast the month of Ramadan, and you perform the pilgrimage to the house if you are able to do so. Jibreel then asked, and what is Iman? He replied that you have Iman in Allah, His angels, His books, His messengers, in the resurrection after death, and that you have Iman in Al-Qadr, it, 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 in Al-Qadr it's good and bad. Jibreel then questioned, and what is his son? He answered that you worship Allah as if you can see Him, and if you are not able to see Him, then He indeed sees you. The Prophet said at the end of the Adit, that was Jibreel, that, that was Jibreel. He came to teach you a deen, thus He made all of this part of the deen. The term ad-deen embodies in the meanings of loneliness, submission, and, uh, and humility. It is said, uh, din tuhu fadana, that is, I subdued him, so he, so he humbled. He also said, yadinu, 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 yadinu Allah, Allaha, or yadinu lillah. He worships Allah or obeys him and submits to him. That's din of Allah is worship, obedience and submission to him. As for ibadah, its original meaning also denotes loneliness and submission. One says, one, one says, a power that, 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 that is, that is mubad, yani, mubad, that is it, it has become smooth, smooth, smooth out because of being traded upon. However, the ibadah that has been enjoying, enjoying upon us encompasses the meaning of submission along with the meaning of love. It embodies the utmost, the utmost degree of submission of Allah, sazawajal, through the utmost degree of love of Him. The final level of love it is is a is a is a is a ta a ta a ta a ta a ta a ta ta yum that is enslavement, infatuation, captivation, and adoration. It is initial level is ali al al alaka that is connection because of the heart connection to the to the beloved. Thereafter comes the level of a sabaha that is craving, longing, and desire. Sababa and sababa no sababa sahaba. As the heart starts to crave for the beloved. Next is the level of al gharam that is love, passion, and loveliness, which is the love that is inseparable from the heart. Thereafter, al-ishq, the, that is ardent and passionate love, and its final level is tayyum. One says, tayyum of Allah, that is the adabd of Allah. That the mutayyum is the mubad of his beloved. One who submit to a person while possessing hatred for him is not an abid, the worshiper. Of him, uh, and in, in contrast, if, if he was to love someone and at the same time, at the same time, does not submit to him, he is likewise not an up to him, as is the case of man who loves his child and uh, and, 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 and and friend. Uh, this place of yani uh, in the case of a man who loves his child and a friend doesn't bring any meaning. Consequently, uh, only one of the two qualities is not sufficient as for as as for as far as the ibadah of Allah Subhanahu wa Taala is concerned. Rather, it is necessary that Allah be the most beloved of all of, of above all, all all else to the abd, and that He holds Allah to be the greatest of all. Indeed, none other than Allah deserves total love and submission. Moreover, any that is loved for other than Allah, love of such a thing that is is, is unsound, and anything that is glorified without the order of Allah, will show no such thing is false. Allah Subhanahu wa Taala says. قل إن كان أباؤكم وأبناؤكم وإخوانكم وأزواجكم وشيرتكم وأمالكم اقترفتموها جنة تصنع كسدها ومساكين تردونها بإليكم من الله ورسوله وجهاد في سبيله فتربصوا تأتي الله بأمره. Say if your fathers, your sons, your brothers, your wives, your kindred, the world that you have gained, the commands in which you fear are declined, and the dwellings in which you delight are dearer to you than Allah and His Messenger and, uh, and the striving hard and fighting in His cause, then wait until Allah brings about His, his, his decision torment. Thus, the genius, the, the genius of love should be for Allah and the Messenger, as in the case of obedience. Obedience is for Allah and its Messenger, and pleasing is for Allah and its Messenger. Wallahu wa rasoolu haqqu an yaruduhu. But it is more befitting that they should please Allah and its Messenger. The issue of the issue of bestow also belongs to Allah and its Messenger. Wallahu annahum raddu ma ta'ahum Allah wa rasoolu. It is only they had been content with what Allah and its Messenger give, gave them. As for Ibadah, that which relates to it, such as Tawakul, fear and the like, these are for none other than Allah alone. As Isa has said, Kuliyah ala kitabi ta'alu ila kalimatin sawa'in bayna wa bayna kuala na'udha illallah 
ولا نشرك به شيء ولا تكذب بعضنا بعضا ربابا من دون الله فإن تولوا فقولوا أشهدوا بأننا مسلمون So people of the book come to our this is just to you uh, that, that is just to you and us that, that we worship none but Allah that we associate with nothing in worship with him and that none of us shall take others as lords besides Allah then if they turn away say be a witness that we are Muslims Allah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala also said ولو أنهم سردوا ما تهم الله ورسوله وقال سبحان الله سيوتين الله من فضله ورسوله إن إلى ربنا راغبون If only they had been contented contented with what Allah and his messenger gave them and, and, and had said Allah is sufficient for us Allah and his messenger will give us of his bounty It is Allah that we, it is Allah that we implore to enrich us Hence the issue of a bestow, bestow belongs to Allah and his messenger as he sallallahu alayhi wa said وما أتاكم رسوله فأخذوه وما نأكم منه فانتهى ونص أن whatever the messenger gives you take it and whatever he forbids you from abstain from it as for al hasb which 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 is what the suffices is is it is Allah alone as Allah صلى الله عليه وسلم said الذين قاله الناس إن الناس قد جمعوا لهم فأخشوهم وزادهم إيمان وقالوا أسبن الله ونعم الوكيل those that the believers unto whom the people That is the applicant said, Verily the people have gathered against you in the moment of a great army. So fear them, however, it only increased them in Iman. And they said, Our husband, that is, that is only one who suffices, one who suffices us, is Allah, and how fine a trust he, he is. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala also says, Ya ayyuhan nabiyu hasbuka Allah man ta'aba kamal mu'minin. O Prophet, your husband, that is one who suffices, uh, as well as those who follow you of the believers. Is Allah that is Allah is one who suffices you and the believers who follow you as for the one who pre presumes the meaning to be the one who suffices you or Muhammad is Allah and the believers to get to get together then he has committed an atrocious error as well as, as we have already clarified this in different place he also is Allah has also said alayhi sallallahu bi kafin abdahu it's not Allah sufficient for is it's not Allah sufficient for his abd The clarification of this is that the term Abd refers to the to the to the Mu'abbad, whom Allah has sub sub subjugated. So Allah subdues, governs, and uh, administers him. From this perspective, all creatures are the ibad of Allah, the righteous as well as the immoral, the believers, the believers, the inhabitant of paradise and the habitat of the fire, since Allah is the Lord and the owner of them all. None can escape his will, his will, omnipotence and his perfect words. With, with which no righteous or uh, uh, unrighteous person can transgress. Whatever he has willed will come to be even if they have not willed it. And whatever they will will not come to be if he does not will it. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, أَفَغَيْرَ دِينِ اللَّهِ يَبْغُونَ وَاللَّهُ أَسْلَمَ مَنْ فِي السَّمَاوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضُ وَأَنُوْ كَرْهًا وَإِلَيْهِ يُرْجَعُونَ Do they? Do they, I na'am, na'am, do they think, do they then seek other than the deen of Allah? While all that is in the heavens and the earth have submitted to him willingly or unwillingly, and to, he, and, 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 and to him they shall all be returned. Thus he subhanahu wa ta'ala subhanahu wa ta'ala is the Lord of the worlds. They are created, they are provided, they are the one who bestows life upon them and causes their death, the one who fluctuates their hearts and the one who disposes disposes of their, their of their affairs. They, they do not have any other lord, they do not have any other king and honor, and they do not have any other creator, irrespective of whether they admit it or deny it, and whether they are aware of it or are ignorant of it. However, the people of Iman know, know of it and believe in it, a, a contrast to the contrast to the to the one who is ignorant of it, say of it, or reject it, being arrogant towards his lord, not acknowledging or submitting to it with the full knowledge that Allah is this lord and creator. Whenever knowledge of the truth is accompanied with arrogance towards accepting it and denial, and it's, and it's denial, it will be a reason for punishment for its processor. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, وَجَاهَدُوا بِهَا وَاسْتَكَنَتَهَا أَنفُسَهُمْ دُلْمُنَ الْأُوَنْ فَهَنْدُرْ كَيْفَ كَانَ كِبَوْتُ الْمُسِدِينَ And deny them, that is Allah, 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 Allah sign, and justly and arrogantly, though their own selves were convinced, con con convinced of them. So, see what was the end of the Mufsidin. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala also says, الذين أتوا الكتاب يعرفونه كما يعرفون أبنائهم وإن فريقا من الكتب ملحقهم يعلمون. Those to whom we give the scripture, that is the Jews and the Christian, he recognizes him that is Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم. I recognize their own sons. However, part of them indeed conceal the truth. 
why they know it. That, and that is in reference to the to the to the, to the, to the, the descriptions of, of Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, which are written in the Torah and Injil. Allah also Allah subhanahu wa taala also says, "Fa'inna kum la yukad, fa'inna kum la yukad dibunak, wa la kinna dalimna biyati la jahdun." Indeed, it's not you that Muhammad sallallahu that is Muhammad Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam that they deny, but it but it is it is the signs that is the that is the ayat of the Quran of Allah that they the dalimun deny. Therefore, if the Abdu knows that Allah is his Lord and created and that he is in need of him, then he is aware of the Ubudiyya that is related to the worship, the worship of, of Allah. This Abd asks of his Lord, beseech him and relies upon him. There, however, he may obey his command or he may disobey it. He, all, he may also worship him and he may worship shaitan and idols. This category of Ubudiyya does not uh, distinguish the people of paradise from the people of the fire. For, for no other does a person become, become a Muslim or account of it. As Allah, as Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, among them believe not in Allah except that they attribute patronas unto him. In fact, the Mushrikeen at the time at the time of the Prophet used to acknowledge that Allah is the creator, and with that they used to worship other other than other than him. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Wala insulta Allah, and very if you ask them who created the heavens and the earth, they should, they will they will surely reply, they will surely reply Allah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, كُلِّمَنِ الْأَرْضُ مَنْ فِيهِمَا مِنْ فِيهَا إِنْ كُنْتُمْ إِنْ كُنْتُمْ تَعْلَمُونَ سَيَقُولُ لِلَّهِ كُلَّ فَلَا تَذَكَّرُونَ قُلْ مَنْ رَبُّ السَّمَاوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضِ وَرَبُّ الْعَرْشِ الْعَظِيمِ سَيَقُولُ لِلَّهِ كُلَّ فَلَا تَذَكَّرُونَ قُلْ مَنْ بِيَدِهِ مَلَكُوتُ كُلِّ شَيْءٍ وَهُوَ يُجِيرُ وَلَا يُجَارُ عَلَيْهِ إِنْ كُنْتُمْ تَعْلَمُونَ سَيَقُولُ لِلَّهِ كُلَّ فَأَنَّا تُسْهَرُونَ Say to who does the earth and whosoever is within it belong to? If you truly know, they will reply to Allah. Say, will you not then remember? Say, who is the Lord of the seven heavens and the Lord of the great throne? They will reply, that belongs to Allah. Say, will you not then fear Allah? Say, in whose hand is the severity of everything and he protects all? Well, it's against, against him. There is no protector. If indeed you know, they will reply, it belongs to Allah. Say, then how is that you are, dece you are deceived and averse from the truth? Many of those who speak about, the tr about this truth and constantly be a witness to it do not witness except by this, by this very truth. It is, it, it is the universal truth of which it, of which it is true with, with witness of it and knowledge of it are, a co 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 are, are a common to the believer, the disbeliever, the righteous and the unrighteous. Indeed, even Iblis and the people of the fire admit to this, to this truth. Iblis said, Rabbi My Lord, give me the respect until the day the, the day that is the dead are resurrected. He also said, Rabbi Oh my Lord, because you misled me, I shall indeed, I shall indeed uh, adorn the path of error for them that is mankind on earth, and I shall indeed mislead them all. Also said, then by your might, I will surely mislead them all. He also said, Do you see this one whom you have honored above me? If you grant, if you grant me respect that is keep me alive to the day of resurrection, I will surely cut the roots of his offspring by sending them astray all by a few. There are other instances of such such as such as such an, an address where Iblis acknowledged that Allah is his Lord and creator and the creator of all others. Similarly, the people the people of the fire said, Kalu Rabbana Falabadarina Shakwatana Kunna Komandalimin, they say our Lord, our wretchedness of overwhelmed us and we were an an erring people. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says concerning them, Walo Tara idu 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 and uh, and uh, at a merely acknowledging, acknowledging it, but does not establish the religious truth that Allah has commanded him with, which is the worship of him that pertains to his uluhiyya, obedience of his command and his messengers, will be of the same genre as Iblis and the people of the fire. Moreover, if such a person presumes himself to be among us, the light of Allah, uli, uh, uh, of Allah's uliya, the people of Ma'arifa, Ma and in Idibat, who are beloved of any religious commands and, and prohibitions, he will be of the worst people of Kuf and the of 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 an Il Ahad. Whosoever imagined that Al Qadr and others beside him were not answerable to the command because they had witnessed the will of or something similar to that, such a person profession is the is is the, is one of the most evil attendants of the believers in Allah and it's just until he enters into the second type of meaning of Allah uh, of Al Abd. This is the con 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 notion of Al Abd uh, Al Abd as Al-Abid, the worshipper. 
Hence, we should be a worship of Allah, not worshiping anything but Him. Therefore, obeying His command and that of His messenger. Having allegiance with the awliya of Allah, uh, the believers and the purest ones, and holding unwisely towards his enemies. This ibadah pertains to, to, pertains to the ilahiyah of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And this is why the epitome of Tawheed was la ilaha illallah. None has, the, none has the right to be worshipped in truth except Allah. Uh, but in, in contrast to the one who acknowledges the lordship of Allah but does not worship him, or one who worships, uh, Allah, worships alongside him another deity. Thus the, il the, the ilah is what the heart the defies with lo total love, glorification, reverence, grand grand grandeur, fear, hope, and such matters. This is the ibad Allah loves and is pleased with. With it, He dedicated the, the chosen of His slaves, and within it, He sent the messengers. As for the as, as, as for the connotation of Allah as being the subdued one, the irrespective of whether He maintains it or rejects it, this meaning is common to both the believer and disbeliever. Through the, dis the, the disparity between these two types, one can distinguish the difference between the, relig the religious linea, realities that pertain to the worship of Allah, his religion and his legislative command, we we which he loves, is placed with, offers Allah to his people, and honors them with his garden, and between the universal, uh, universal conia, letters are common to both the believer and disbeliever, and the righteous and the unrighteous. And, and, and the Whoever limits himself to the universal realities and does not accede to the religious, religious realities is, is, is of the followers of the of the accused bliss and of the of the of the disbelievers in the Lord of the Worlds. As for the of the one who limits himself to the to some of the mat these matters, that's religious realities, and for and for and for and for against others, or in an only certain standings or circumstances, he is Iman and Uliya will are with Allah, decrease according to the to the to the decrement that is present of the religious realities. This is the tremendous era in which the errant ones were mistaken and in which confusion increased upon the travelers and upon the travelers to Allah, the extent that the number of senior sheikhs who alleged that they were people of Tahakik, Tawheed and Irfan, but who slept in the this regard cannot be enumerated by Allah, who knows the secrets and the and the revealed. Sheikh Abdul Qadir pointed out this very thing as in in mention of him. He explained that when many people arrive at, uh, at the topic of uh, al qadar or al qadar they refrain, but not me, as a, as, a, as, a, as a window has been opened it for me, and I, con I contain the decrease of truth uh, with the truth for the truth. Moreover, a real man is one who contains with al qadar not one who sanctions it. What? What has been mentioned by Sheikh may Allah have mercy upon him is what Allah and his messenger have commanded. However, many people have erred in this regard. They may witness the disobedience and sins that have been ordained upon one of them or another person, or even indeed it is it is it is kufr. He witness that this is occurring by the will of Allah and by his qadr and al-qadr, and as being included within the command of his worship and the dictates of his will. Hence they believe that acceptance of this agreement of it and the co and the um, and the contentment of it and so on where is part of the deen, the way at uh, the way and worship in such a kind as they resemble the Mushrikin who said No Sha Allah Mashrakna wala abauna wala 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 haramna mi shain if Allah had will we will not have taken part of partners in worship with him, nor will our fathers, and we will not have forbidden anything against his will. He said, uh, shall we feed those whom if Allah will, he himself will have, will have, will have filled. And they said, if it had been the will of the most beneficent Allah, we should not have worshipped them. If they had been rightly guided, they would have they would have understood that we have been ordered to be content with Al Qadr and to be patient with it, with its injections in the calamities that afflict us, such as poverty, sickness, and fear. Allah Subhanahu wa Taala said, "Ma asabin musibat illa bi Allah, wa ma yu'min billahi hadi kalba." No, no calamity be false, but the, the, by the but, but by the mission of Allah, and whosoever believes in Allah, he gets his heart. Some of the Salaf have said this in reference to the person who is afflicted with a calamity, but he but but he knows that it is from Allah, and therefore he is content with it and can be submitted to it. Allah Subhanahu wa Taala also says, "Ma asabin musibat fi al-adwa la fintu illa fi kitab min kamil nabrahi na darik Allah yasir liki la tasalla ma fatu kala tafi ma taqwa la la fi ma taqum." So no, no calamity befalls on earth or, or in yourself, but it is, it is recorded in a book before we bring it. That is the calamity into existence. Verily, that is easy for Allah in order that you may not be sad over matters that you fall of you fail to gain. Nor rejoice at that which you have you ha, you, ha, you which has been given to you. It's reported in the Sahihain. 
Nabi Muhammad SAW said, Adam and Musa had an argument. Musa said, You are Adam, whom Allah created with his son, into, into whom he bred the soul. He created for you to, uh, the soul, he created for you. To whom he made the angels possess and whom he taught the names of everything. So why have you expelled us from, your, from, your, from yourself from paradise? Adam replied, You are Musa, whom Allah favored with this message and his speech. Ah. <laughs> You are Musa, whom Allah favored with this message and his speech. Have you not found that, that, that this had been written upon me before I was ever created? Musa replied, Yes. Then he said, he, That is the message of Allah, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, remarked, that Adam got the better of Musa in the argument. Note that Adam did not prove his argument over Musa by means of Al-Qadr, thinking that the sinna can use Al-Qadr as an argument. Therefore, this is not accepted by any Muslim, nor any sense if this had been an excuse, it would have quality been one of Iblis, the people of Noah, the people of Hud, and every, and every disbeliever. Likewise, the Muslim not a sense Adam over the sin itself, as Adam had repented to his Lord, and his Lord then closed him and guided him. Musa, however, censored him over the, as the resultant calamity that befell them because of the sin. That this is why Musa asked, So why have you expelled us and, and yourself from paradise? And Adam answered, This is what had this this is what had been recorded upon me before I was I was I, I, I was I was created. Hence the action and, and the resultant calamity upon upon him were ordained. The calamities that are ordained must be submitted to, as this is from the perfection of being pleased with Allah as Lord. As for sins, it is not for the Ab to commit sins, and if, the, if, if he does so, it is upon him to seek forgiveness and repent. Thus he repents from all types of sins, and especially with calamities. Allah SWT says, Fasbir, inna wa adal haqun wa astafili dambik. So be patient of Muhammad, the verily promise of Allah is true, and I ask forgiveness for your, for your, for your fault. Allah SWT says, وَإِن تَسْبِرُوا وَتَتَّقُوا وَلَا دُونَكُمْ كَيْدًا شَيْعًا But if you remain patient and pious, not the least harm will have will there, where will their cunning do to you. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala also says, وَإِن تَسْبِرُوا وَتَتَّقُوا فَإِنَّ ذَلِكَ مِنْ أَزْبِ الْأُمُورِ But if you preserve patient and are pious, indeed, then will then what will that then that will be a matter of great resolution. Yusuf, Yusuf radiallahu anhu said, إِنَّهُ مَنْ يَتَّقِي وَيَسْبِرْ فَإِنَّ اللَّهِ يُدْعِ أَجْرَ الْمُحْسِنِينَ Valley who if he has Allah and his patience, then surely Allah makes not the reward of the good doers to be to be lost.